So these are, uh, this is my little intro for you guys in eventually meeting up with you guys at South by Southwest. This is a bullet point uh, synopsis of ideas so that way you can better prepare for how we try to move the needle a little, little bit from uh, good to legendary at South by Southwest where we're going to, to do a lot of the things that my mentor Mark McCormick taught me. It's all going to center around putting leads into a bucket, but this bucket's actually going to be uh, a bucket of leads, a, a, a funnel of leads inside of something that's very almost sacrosanct and awesome, which is the Mark McCormick War, war Room. And the War Room is basically how we try to win at South by Southwest. And Okay, those are some generalities. The worm just collects leads. Uh, let's get into some specifics. You guys have been working on a notebook on what they will never teach you at Stanford Business School. This notebook is going to be uh, something that you carry with you. It's going to have bit.ly links in it. It's going to have the three anchor events. Uh, one anchor event being the launch party for South by Southwest Interactive at midnight plus one minute. That is on... Thursday evening at midnight, uh, another anchor event. So there's anchor plus satellite. Anchor like ship's anchor, satellite like what's in space. Anchor plus satellite. So the anchor event is an awesome event, and the satellite is a peripheral. So Friday night, we are doing a Shark Tank event that's at Parkside. Okay, Parkside, and then on Monday night uh, at Bat Bar. Bat like. Uh, the bats and there's a bat bridge which is a uh, nighttime bridge comes out the bats come up let's go over some things that are salesy networky uh, in helping us try to do as best as we possibly can in mixing and mingling at South by Southwest the faster we can go from selling ourselves to letting the other person sell us uh, is the better that we all do as salespeople. And these are a couple things for, for Get Chitter. We are a glorified second stage premium. And the premium that we're doing is chasing the first stage premium. I'm bored of Chitter, and this is actually stuff that you'll say. I'm kind of bored of Chitter. I mean, we dominate even though we're so new, but it bores me. I, not that I'm not excited about it, but let's just talk about you. And plus, we've got a wait list. We've got too many customers already. Transitioning from teasing, which is basically glorified one-up one up photo uploads, to two-up photo uploads. Yeah, I mean, we did the Mr. Peabody launch. Did you hear about that? We launched, uh, we did the movie premiere party for that. Uh, we did it also in four other cities before South by Southwest, which have bit.ly links to it. We did it in Cambridge, or the Boston area, uh, bit.ly VC0311G8, and then G8A, G8B, G8C, G8, the number 8, E is an elephant. That's actually on that bit.ly link summarizer. I think it's on page 38 of your book, What They Will Never Teach You at Stanford Business School, about EUTWM PPM, Engineer Up a Tidal Wave Momentum Perpetual Promotion Machine. EUTWM PPM. That's a hashtag. Tweet at me at it. At this point in the video, uh, pause it and then tweet at me, EUTWM PPM, at Larry Chang, hashtag go get Twitter. Go like, stop, get like, have it, uh, chitter. C-H-I-T-T-E-R. When you pitch people, I need to hear this. You need to re-say your name. You can't just be like, oh yeah, uh, go, hashtag go get chitter. It's, it's spelled out succinctly. And get chitter. C-H, like this badge. See this badge? Get chitter. Go get chitter's our hashtag. It helps you get a VIP bracelet. People are gonna be drunk. We're not drinking. People are gonna be drunk and it's loud, and remember, if they're older than 35 years old, and I know that there's female team members with us, scream. I have this theory. I've already met awesome women, 
But I have this theory of why women uh, kind of don't do as well as they should. They don't scream inside of boardrooms. Older men can't hear. If he's older than like 30, older than like 40, or really old, like 45 or something, they can't hear anything. You gotta scream way past, past the, the camera. The anchor event on Monday, we're gonna be funneling in people and we're gonna be collecting leads on pieces of paper. This is a four up, okay? Where it's simply going to be first name, last name, email, cell phone, okay? That's it. That's what we want. That's on a piece of paper. When you're networking with people, you want to close people, okay, close them. We have a wait list. Close them on a cell phone. Close them on a cell phone number. Guys do this. Guys are pros at doing this. Uh, tell me your cell phone. I'll call you so I have your number. And they'll take out their phone and they'll look down. Then stop talking, okay? Then stop talking. They'll say the number or this is what happens when you're when you're me, okay, supermodel and founder and New York Times bestseller author and actor and model. I'm gonna say model twice. Sometimes the woman or the seasoned executive, they'll just take my phone from me and punch it in because they want to make sure they punch in the number right. All we're doing is collecting leads. We're collecting cell phone numbers. Okay, that's all we're doing. That's for the war room. We want to try to get our money back. Actually, me and Seth already got our money back before we came to this thing. So this homework, okay, I want us, we're all in danger. We're in entrepreneurship. I want to be able to get all of our money back before we go. And, and well, Seth and I have already gotten your money back, but you got to do your part too. And pff, I don't even, I'm not even an employee. You guys chipped in on my flight. Thank you. But let's do this, right? We want to try to get a bunch of our ROI before we even go. Collecting names, they go into the war room, and you're going to have three things that are in sequence. I love sequences, I love patterns, I love pattern replication, pattern iteration, whereas you want to let me or Mark McCormick do your pattern recognition in sequence. Have people actually do a contract where you will lay down a piece of paper with a contract that actually very few people will sign. That's okay. You don't want to sign it? I don't want to pressure you. We have a wait list. We're almost sold out of our app. Why don't we do this? It'll make you comfortable. Why don't we do a one-way letter of intent, one-way letter of intent combined with internal escrow. That's just like anchor plus satellite, okay? One-way letter of intent, internal escrow, EUBM, that's a hashtag, engineer up a business model. Basically, we're just loading up pictures on social media with one-offs. Well, with a second stage premium, it's a two-off. But just like the book that I made you guys make, that's a 17-off. Meaning you get and you connect with me and what I'm trying to do by watching the video, making a posted note, slapping it on that page, doing, see, do, read, do, read, execute, do, do, read, do. So what you're trying to do is combine, hi, I'm doing a video where, I know, <laughs> so professional, this studio. So see, do, read, do, and then tweet and that way you text and combine the the you, you combine them so that way you get the mentor mentee and eventually mentor mentee mind melt where you're combining the 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 trade-offs that's EUBM engineer up a business model and those are stepwise sequentially in addition to anchor plus satellite and our company hashtag go get chitter which is uh, rewarding customers for doing these things. Now, over here, there's this presentation which is gonna help our war room, which is where the money room, it's basically a, a money room, which is why it's so important. How to do what Get Chitter does without having to hire Get Chitter. 
It's specifically the pattern that's replicated that a different mentor told me about, Dave McClure, which is how to do what Duck9 does without having to hire Duck9. It's genius. I presented it in 2007 at uh, iMedia. I got X amount of revenue. I got paid. The conclusion that every seasoned executive gets when is confronted with, I'm sorry, I'm going to have to put you on the wait list, read my slide share, how to do what Larry Chang does without having to hire Larry Chang. First of all, I'm curious because I want to hear three or four things which you need to do. And then after I hear those things, guess what the conclusion is? I should hire you guys, right? Nobody wants to do anything. People can do their own job. You think they're going to like do some contractor's job or some future contractor job?